Good morning uh, from Misty Drizzly uh, Glen Almond in Scotland. It's 8 35 a.m. We left our campsite just now. I'm so mad. I kept reminding myself, take a picture of the campsite with the tents, you know, up. But I was too tired. We were too tired. And this morning I reminded myself again before I broke my broke down my tent. Took a picture, forget. <sighs> So we have no pictures of our tents in the campsite. Anyway, um, we have five miles to the end of this map, which is Loch Fruki, and then 12 and a half to Aberfeldy, where we're gonna take a zero tomorrow. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. My legs are so sore. I have a little bit of skin irritation on the inside of my feet, both of them from being wet, I think. I thought it was gonna be a blister, but no, it's actually uh, callus forming, which is good. Uh, yesterday it was uh, hurting a little bit. Mm. What else? Here's what it looks like. We saw a few Monroes yesterday, I believe. One of them is Ben Hoinsey. This morning, I forced myself to eat some rice. <sighs> didn't feel like eating. Um, yesterday, I didn't eat and I had no energy. So today, I forced myself to eat. So I don't feel like a zombie, but it was hard. It was a lot of rice. <laughs> Whew, I'm behind in editing videos. When we take a zero tomorrow, I have three videos to edit. <laughs> That's gonna take six hours. <laughs> it's just not a day off after all. <laughs> it's never a day off, but I love it. I love laying there and editing. Um, plus I can relive our hike that day. <laughs> so it's a hard work, you guys. Make sure you subscribe. <laughs> Oh, it's so cute! <laughs> oh, you're getting all wet and dirty. Ask it. Who gives his belly? Pretty excited. <laughs> hi, hi. Ask him, playing. ask him. Ask him what? The question. Which one? Do, Do you know Bobo? <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> How are you doing? Good morning. Hey. Yeah, That's a golf, golf course we're camping at. Sandra, come on. It was a nice hey. flat spot. It was perfect for, for our I thought it I thought it was a campsite. <laughs> <laughs> come on. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Where are you guys headed? Have a building. Oh nice. Yeah. Very good. Ultimately we're going to <laughs> Cape Wrath. Ada, come on. Thank you. So, so Ultimately, we're going to Cape Wrath. Oh, wow. Distracted by the dogs and talking to the lad, we missed our left turn and kept walking straight for one mile. That one's a 789 meter. Too bad it's uh, cloudy, foggy. There's a lot of tall mountains surrounding us. Oh no, we're going the wrong way. We kept going where we're supposed to turn left when we hit that Ochna Free whatever village. So it's more than one kilometer wasted. Oh, <laughs> Ben Duram. You're supposed to navigate. That's okay, it's only one kilometer. <sighs> so we're actually a mile, more over a mile off track walking back now so we're adding about two plus miles into our hike today oh. Oh. oh this is it yeah so my watch says we've walked 
three and a half miles, how much of that is our correct trail mile? <laughs> well, we walked about a mile and a quarter out of our way and a mile and a Total? quarter back. Oh, shh. So, so about an hour. We burned about an hour. Uh, we wasted an hour and we only walked an actual one trail mile then. One and a half, maybe. One and a half. Yeah, All right, that's done and over with. Don't, right. let's not be complacent, uh, let's stay complacent. Wait, complacent is what? Don't be complacent? Yeah, don't be complacent. In my defense, it's a well-known fact that my navigational skills are substandard, so. So it's my fault then, I should be paying attention. <laughs> it's my fault for trusting him to navigate. <laughs> but the view was so beautiful that we didn't, we're too busy looking around. I'm hot now, I need to shed this jacket or something. Huh. We miss a trail again. Not far this time. I didn't even bother to check because it the road looks like it's obvious that we should go here, but huh. Should be a left turn coming up soon. Okay, that small trail on the left. We're supposed to go this way. <laughs> oh. Is it up there? Yeah. We're going up there. Wow. <laughs> yeah, let's go to the right, that's right. This narrow and tilted. Looks like we're gonna be on this kind of path for about a mile to a loch, loch of Mullen. Man, today I thought it's gonna be easy day bobo, but we were wrong. <laughs> I don't know what happened to our... We didn't see this coming. We thought it was gonna be like the road, 4x4 four four track like before. <laughs> uh, hopefully we'll make it to the hotel before 8. Yeah, we don't get lost. There's a walk and a small lake there, but it's a white out so we can't really see it. Beautiful. Where to go? Water is so clear, and there's a hole in that rock. Oh! <laughs> wow! <laughs> I 
There are ducks swimming, so cute. Thank goodness. used to it from last year. Finally arrived at La Fruji. Ooh, I feel so long. Such a journey to get here through the bogs that Ben didn't like at all. <laughs> his feet are still swimming in his shoes, he said. Um, that was a tough section but yesterday too. Um, but we're starting a new map now from Lofruki to Aberfeldy, 12 and a half miles of road, a lot of road. So the map says easy trail, Bobo. <laughs> what time is it now? About noon, 12.03. I guess 12 and a half miles will be there in five hours with stopping probably five and a half. So about 5.30 or six. Yay. Uphill I've never seen a road this steep Ben doesn't only dislike the bug but also he dislikes this road <laughs> What are you looking forward to is a day off Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just think of our zero tomorrow. Or maybe the next day too, who knows. <laughs> Almost to the end of this steep hill. There's a cell tower at the top. <laughs> Might be a good place to upload a video. <laughs> Even a hand sanitizer. <laughs> what the heck? What? Why? <laughs> why? I know. There can't be anything in there. No, I don't think so. But why put it there at all? <laughs> so weird. How much you have COVID <laughs> in the middle of nowhere? <laughs> Who would catch COVID here? Oh, I'm so tired, you guys. I need a zero so badly. My feet hurt, my knees feel tight. I feel like I'm gonna get a blister, but I'm not sure. Uh, just tired. My whole legs are throbbing. Uh, I've been ready for a zero since Comrie, actually. So tired, I don't think I'm gonna make it, Ben Ram. Yeah, you can, you've done this before. And we've gone 40 miles in two days. Oh, my can't stop feet. now with just the last four miles in sight. My feet hurt and then my ankle, I twisted it so many times in that bog. <sighs> Three more miles. One more Steps here is killing our knees.
Finally made it. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. Wow. Kitchen and everything. I'm scared to check my feet. I don't know if it's the party or the walking, but something's chafing my ass. Oh, let me Farting or the walking, but something's chafing my ass. Oh, okay, let me. <laughs> no blister though. It's puny. <laughs> Ow. Uh. <laughs> we are broken. We might need two zeros. Thinking about it. Went to town and got a new gas can. And I'm not gonna carry this, but I need conditioner for my hair. We stock up for the, we stock up food for the next um, three days. We're gonna be here because we're taking double zero days. Drying our tent. My nose already dry right there. Ben's drying his tent. Yeah, busy day on zero day. <laughs> Even though you may not smell dirty, you're dirty on the train. Yeah, look at that. Bog water, man. <laughs> <laughs> Hiker chores. <laughs> Why is your side browner than mine? <laughs> Am I more dirty? <laughs> oh no! Yeah, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. Teamwork! <laughs>